Mark, we really had to battle for the three points tonight. How pleased is everyone there? Yeah, buzzing. Um, it's a hard win, to be honest. The win didn't help both teams. Um, first half, I thought we got most of the ball, but the intensity wasn't probably there for us. It didn't create as much as we wanted to. It was a bit slow. Um, but now second half, I think it opened up a bit for both teams, really. But we're on the front foot for most of the game, and we got what we deserved in the end. Well, I'm sure when you signed for Hartlepool on lawn, people mentioned the wind. Up. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Hartlepool tonight, wasn't the it? The wind, the rain, the cold, the snow. <laughs> it's unbelievable up here. I can't believe how cold it is. <laughs> but uh, yeah, nights like this, just Tuesday night, you know, January, it's weather conditions, etc. But it doesn't matter, you've got, you've got to get a win. It's the same with both teams. Um, but no, it was a good, good win in the end. It is the same, but how much does it impact? I know we tried to play some football still, didn't we? But it must have an impact, the, the conditions like that. I think you can see from the goal kicks, you can, it's impossible to judge a ball. Both teams, obviously, but like it does, it changes the dimension of the game, if anything. Um, probably make decisions you wouldn't do if, if the weather was... But anyway, it doesn't matter, but as you can see, it has an effect, yeah. And then the second half was when the game really came to life, wasn't it? You know, we got ourselves in front and then managed to shoot ourselves in the foot. We kind of make things hard for ourselves, don't we? We, uh, we do, yeah. We do, collectively, we do, yeah. Uh, good entertainment now, I guess, if anything. But like you say, you, you score and then if switch off or something. I don't know what it is, but you can see it and then you've got to go again. But no, I thought um, the lads out wide were great, you know, getting the balls in the box, like I said all the time, look, just flood the box, get in the box, um, and chances will come, and they did. It was a great move for the winning goal. You just drifted in there and found some space, didn't you? Yeah, I don't know, yeah. Um, yeah, I guess it said get in the box as much as you can and get forward. I think the more bodies you get in the box, the more chance you've got of scoring. Uh, but no, Gav, um, Gavin Kitch down the left side has fought a gamble and uh, arrived on time and luckily it went in. How good is that feeling in front of the town end as well? Oh, brilliant, uh, brilliant. You, you can't describe it. At any level you score, score a goal, it's unbelievable. I probably should score more, to be honest. But um, no, it's a feeling you can't describe. Like you say, the, the guys behind the goal on a Tuesday night, especially, you know, all, all got work tomorrow coming out. It's, uh, it's impressive stuff. And how, how important was it to get that win tonight? Because we, we've been talking about trying to get in a winning run. It needs to yeah. kind of happen, doesn't um, it? Unbelievably important. I mean, we said before the game, just three points. We've got a win. It was a must-win game. Even though it's in January, it was a must-win game. I mean, we've got the two games and the thing. Is that right? And then, um, obviously, we go to Dover and Saturday. And again, must-win to get ourselves up there. Like, everybody wants to be in the playoffs. Everybody wants to have something to fight for at the end of the season. And, um, yeah, nice like this. You've, you've got a win. You've got, you've got to um, get the three points. And we did, so happy days.